Yo guys, what's up? This is Tom from Unreal Mad and welcome back to a new video. In this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to make your Unreal Engine scene more atmospheric and how to make God Rays. So let's start. We are in Unreal Engine here and I have this cube. Let's duplicate it. And another time. So we can make some light float through. And so let's go to visual effects and grab the exponential height fog and we can go down first of all let's increase the fog density and the fog height of to zero so decrease it the color let's set it to yellow so we are like in the desert and you can change the opacity how you like these are just my personal preferences for the God Rays. And we can scroll down to volumetric fog right here. And let's increase that number a little bit. Okay, this looks good. The next step, we have to rotate our sun. So let's go to the sun, rotate it. And that the sun floats through here and you can lightly see the effect there's no big change this is because we have to go to the sun and to light shafts then light shafts occlusion and light shaft bloom and now we can see there are some little god rays yeah this looks good you can see the god rays and if i were in a closed room i could see them better this looks very nice. Now you can play with the stuff here. I think at zero, this looks good. The shadows are a little bit too black for me, but like this, it's nice. And you can increase the bloom scale. This looks very nice too. It's like shining in your face. It's very bright. Yeah, when you look in the sun, it's very bright and you have a nice atmosphere. Yeah, this is good for desert and when a sandstorm is going on or something. But if it's not, decrease the number under the fog density. You can use the atmospheric fog too. But I don't use it actually. I use the exponential height fog. And when you want even more atmosphere, you can add volumetric clouds and play with these. I set the bottom altitude to zero so they are very very close to the ground and yeah layer height you can vary it stuff i think this looks very nice yeah what i recommend too is when you have reflective stuff like metal materials water or something uh sphere reflection captures and that's basically all i have to say you can add post process volumes and play with this stuff here like the bloom you can increase it decrease it how you like add depth of field to your camera you can make a really cinematic scene in unreal engine yeah i think that's it with the tutorial i hope you liked it if yes leave a thumbs up if not leave a thumbs down i'll see you next time and bye